No, they should have a menu up with them. Everywhere else has it. I'm just ripping them in one. How's it going? Hi, my name is Karina. Who are you? And I am preparing my snacks for my drive. Gotta get my luggage. Gotta get my clothes out. Figure out what I'm gonna wear. Oh my gosh, I love road trips. I love road trips. I'ma see my mama. I'ma see my papa. I'ma see my siblings. My older brother is probably not gonna be in town with us, but it's okay. I really, 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 really need to also buckle down and get my lines in order because we are opening in a month. I can't believe it. It's literally it's gonna be like four weeks from today. No, June 3rd. Oh, less than a month. All right, I'm gonna go and eat before I stress myself out even more. Catch y'all on the flip side. work bag that is filled to the brim because I have my lunch bag as well with all my snacks and I have snacks in the car because I have to be well prepared for this trip I feel like I'm forgetting something you know it's that point something's missing oh I need my phone I have so many backed up things videos are coming I don't know when I couldn't tell you exactly and I couldn't tell you what they are but I can tell you that they're coming so um Subscribe if you'd like. I would love a, a little comment. Let me know what, what travel plans you have this year, if you have any. If you don't, oh my gosh, great. Because one, you'll save money and also maybe you just need a break from traveling if you're someone. Just, you know, let's chit chat a little bit. I really should get going now. Um, My phone. All right, goodbye room. I will be back in five days. We've officially clocked out and I am preparing my snacks for my drive. My memory card is full, so it cut me out. I have so many backed up things. Anyways, I was saying, I don't have tahine, but I have this chili lime seasoning blend from Trader Joe's that we're gonna have all over this pineapple. Oh, I need to call my mom. I'm gonna call my mom, I'm gonna let her know. Mama, I'm on my way. I haven't seen them since like December. I was supposed to go in February, but the rain was wild. I didn't go because I, you know, want to have my life still. Okay, catch y'all on the flip side. Good morning, it's Tuesday, and you know, I'm not doing too well. I'm like real agitated, I'm really annoyed. I'm sort of like reconnecting with anger. I have a lot of shame behind anger. So that's something that I just need to work through. But you know, the anger is there. I think it might be not necessarily like burnout completely, but it's, it's tiptoeing that line because I've reintroduced a whole new world again into my life. Theater, I'm talking about theater. And I know that it's something that I want to do Today I'm taking my headshots because I really want to like start going at it. And now I, the challenge is figuring out how to deal with my feelings. I need to keep going, you know, like I want to, I want to keep going. Anyways, I'll figure more out later. I was waiting for my friend to call me back. Oh my gosh, look at that, she's called me back. I was on the verge of tears because I was so annoyed. I just hit my tooth. But also, the annoyance I feel also comes from social media. And this sounds so bad. This sounds so bad. And I know it. And listen, this is no knock on anybody specific. It's just that everybody that I follow is so annoying. <laughs> like there isn't any, any, any inspiration, I guess, is, is what I'm saying. That, that, that's a better way of saying. There is no inspiration that I feel from social media, which of course is just... For myself to be like okay then why the hell am i even on it like i don't have to be on it i can't tell if the crux of it is social media itself in which i'm not even that i'm not heavily 
using it either. I, I sincerely think that it's the fact that I'm back in theater, I'm still at work, and work has not slowed down. If anything, it's gotten even faster. And there's just so many challenges and, and new lessons that I've, I've been learning and trying to navigate and, and reconnecting with a bunch of different things from myself. And I'm just overwhelmed. And honestly, I think that this trip, like I love being home. I love seeing my family. I love spending time with my family. Oh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> But I do think that it probably didn't behoove me to have done this trip right now. I think behoove is the right word here. So yeah, we're just learning. There's a lot of learning curves and I'm feeling stressed. But once I get my lines, I just need to run these lines. It's a lot, it's a lot, but we're gonna, I'm gonna just take it to the day enough of this and we're just gonna go and see how today goes. You can go light and then I'm packing away. It's time to go. We got our coffee, but we're gonna get another one. We're gonna get another one. It's almost nine. We're stopping for some coffee. I don't know why I say coffee like that. I know it's coffee. It just feels right. It feels good and it feels right. So I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm at Dutch Bros and I haven't been here. I should probably turn off my music, huh? I'm at Dutch and I haven't been here in like five years, four years. I told the barista that I'd never been here before because I didn't know the menu. I was like, please share with me what's, maybe I should have said what's a popular drink because what i said was do you have anything that's like hazelnut rich smooth so then they were sharing some like mocha truffle caramel and was like ah, that's a lot maybe a golden eagle is what i like so i don't know exactly what i ordered because then i switched it up with oh maybe something that's a little less sweet and then they told me a cinnamon something. So I'm doing a cinnamon mocha something. I have no idea. We're gonna find out. Okay, I stopped off and who knows where. Okay, we're gonna try this and see what is up. Oh, that's very cinnamony. Yeah, this is not what I wanted. <laughs> it's my fault though. No, they should have a menu up with them. Everywhere else has it. I'm just ripping them a new one. for a vanilla latte. I think I need to cool off for a second. Let me reflect on this week. So we had a photo shoot, the shoot yesterday with an old colleague, cohort member. No, my friends, they're my friends. I'm trying to be all professional and not fuck that, that's not me. And it was really good. I'm so happy that my friend went with me because she just knows, she's a director. She went for her MFA. She's like a boss ass bitch. She was guiding me and really, really coaching me through it because <laughs> I don't know how to be serious for most things, so. There we are. And it was great. Oh my gosh. He is incredible. J Slack Images is his photography page. Literally go and look at his work and go and look at his website. He has such an eye for, it's wonderful. It's beautiful. If you are like in the Central Valley, California, Central Valley area, or if you are in the LA area, he'll do both. He can go up and down the up and down the five and the 99 uh to to meet up with you or, or however like to to do some creative things if you're looking for a creative outlet like literally reach out i think this is what i needed too i just needed to like get out of the hustle and bustle i love my family I love them so much. They are near and dear to my heart, forever will be a part of my soul. I also love my silences and I love my slow, quiet mornings and I love not being woken up by everybody making food. And I love that they have breakfast so early in the morning and they love to feed themselves. But damn, damn, there's a man coming up here. 
anyway that's that oh and then i spent that so then after after the shoot we all hung out we got to catch up we went to lunch and then we invited another friend over and yeah we had a little happy hour fun time and then I went to um, another small town near us for my friend's directing interview. And I serendipitously, serendipitously, serendipit That's it, that's the word. I serendipitously just like saw everybody that I hadn't seen. Just, just like magically, they were all just interviewing for the same things and it was, it was so nice. I hadn't seen some of them in like four years, three years. I love reconnecting, I love reconnecting with people. But I, I stayed outside, oh, that was the thing, I stayed outside because I was I was going through my lines. And, every, and so I was just like deep in my script and, and they would walk up and I was like, wait a second, what's going on? Because even they live maybe like an hour away from where we were, so it was cool, it was, it was nice. It was a really great day yesterday. I'm so thankful to have so many people who want the best for me, first of all. So they'll they'll help me out and everything because I know I also started off yesterday a little irritable again I think it's just the morning I need to have just some quiet and then I can get on with the day and you know this was good this was so good so thank you so much for listening you guys thank you so much for listening I really appreciate it so I'm gonna drive now okay pigeons fly so many things okay i need to unpack my car and start the load of wash we got we got things to do now we got to get our life back together we got to go karina you listening to me you got to do it you got to do it okay i'm gonna go boxes and packages and all the things all the things so. Oh. I'm so happy to be home. But now it's go time. I just laid all my stuff onto my bed. And I think I feel stressed again. Luckily it's mostly all dirty clothes anyway because it was hot and I need to wash everything. Oh my gosh. Let's get to it. If I just do it immediately after, and most of it's already super dirty anyway, this should be fairly simple. Everything has a specific place for itself. So just put it back in the spot. That's it. That's it. winded myself. <sighs> I'm so tired. I might not get everything done. I'm just gonna complete as much as I can and then I'll deal with it when I can. As long as I'm ready for tomorrow. Oh, I wanted to go to the grocery store today. Oh no, I was gonna get Mendocino farms. Cause that'll have dinner and then actually I could make something here that is a dinner. Oh, I have chili. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have chili cheese fries tonight. Perfect, perfect. Okay, I'm gonna continue cleaning and then I'm gonna take a shower and then I'm gonna go over my lines again and then we will end this video. Y'all, thank you so much for joining me. Oh, I need to text my mom. Okay, I'm really gonna go now. I'm gonna go text her. We're gonna do, okay, I'll see you guys uh, in the next video. I don't know why I came over me, but I just finished a workout. <laughs> I feel like I might be in that point in time of my life where I need to daily work out to keep my emotions and stress at bay. Oh my gosh, I didn't think I'd ever reach this point. I feel better, honestly, like being home, I don't feel as stressed. Working out just now has really calmed my entire body, really. I needed to get a lot of that energy out, I think. 
And that's what I did. Okay, now I'm really gonna go pace in the streets, y'all. Live, laugh, love. Realize, realize, realize. That's all I got.